Good morning, you two. That's right, Kevin is joining us now, and he is getting ready for volunteers who are going to come help do this monument or mural. Tell us a little bit about it and the idea, where it all began. Well, again, uh, when I saw the victims, um, Holmquist, the second one I saw, had a son about my age, and I think that's what really kind of got me interested in his story. I started reading a little bit more about him and then the rest of the victims. Um, and then there's the controversy over the shooter. And uh, again, I, I said earlier, I think it's real important that we remember the victims and not the shooter, no matter what the reasons. I don't even want to get into that. I think we should remember these, these men who fell. I think that's the important thing to take from this. And Holmquist is going to be the first portrait that you do, but he you're going to line the, the wall with a portrait of each, yeah, each service. Member. Can you tell people how you're going to do this, the uh, process? Well, I do my sketches at home, and then I put them in the computer, and I've got a digital projector that I'll set up across the street, and I'll project the image over here and sketch it up, and then paint on top of that framework. And so folks today, they're going to come out and help you pressure wash, and you were sort of demonstrating why yeah. this is such an important well, step. This is old paint, and it's been out in the sun for years and years and years. And what happens is it degrades, and you get this, this chalk that builds up on the surface. So we're going to pressure wash that off and that'll leave us with a really good strong surface to put a primer on. We'll put two thick coats of primer to help fill all the little nooks and crannies, make it easier to paint on. But the idea is if you've got a good base and a good substrate, you know, this mural could last 25, 35 years. And tomorrow, folks can still come out and help. Yeah, we probably still need volunteers to help tomorrow with priming. It's a big wall. It's about 115 feet down to the end there, and it's, uh, oh gosh, is that 28, 30 feet high? So uh, we could certainly use some volunteers helping with priming tomorrow. We're working in two shifts. We're doing uh, 9 to 12, 1 to 4, 1 to 5, something like that. So. And when do you hope to have this mural complete? Oh, gosh. You don't know? I don't know. It's, it's big. And, um, you know, it'll depend on what I can get done when and... Uh, you know, how much help I can get. Wonderful. Well, it's just another one of those ways that people in our community are just giving back and showing how they can honor those five servicemen. Absolutely. So we're going to be out here waiting around for some of those volunteers to talk to them. Great. Lauren, back to you in the studio.